I'm Sarah from St. Thomas Economic Development, here with another little update from the St. Thomas Megasite. Maybe you find it a bit grating that we keep talking about the process of grading, but while it might look like there isn't a lot of progress happening to the untrained eye, the crews are hard at work making sure that huge strides are being made to prepare the site for the EV battery plant construction, ensuring the foundation for a successful and sustainable project. So more than meets the eye is in the works. In fact, work recently began in the phase two area of the project. Grading a construction site for an industrial development of this scale is a crucial process that involves preparing the land to ensure it's suitable for a building, safe for the workers, and environmentally responsible. Let's break down this process. Before any construction begins, experts evaluate the land to understand its characteristics. They look at the soil type, slope, drainage patterns, and existing vegetation to determine the site's suitability for industrial development. The first step is clearing the site of any trees, vegetation, or debris. Then excavators dig and remove the topsoil to create a level surface for construction. This process helps create a stable foundation. Grading involves reshaping the land to achieve the desired slopes and elevations. This is done using heavy machinery like bulldozers and graders. The goal is to ensure proper drainage, prevent erosion, and create a safe and even surface for construction. Compacting the soil is essential to make it denser and more stable. Compactors, which are large machines that press down on the soil, are used to reduce the risk of settling or shifting of the ground in the future. Proper drainage is crucial to prevent water from pooling on the site, which can cause flooding or erosion. Engineers design systems such as stormwater drains and retention ponds to manage rainwater effectively. Grading takes into account environmental concerns as well. This may involve preserving natural habitats, protecting water sources, and mitigating the impact on local ecosystems. The importance of grading for industrial developments cannot be understated. Grading ensures a stable and level surface for construction, reducing the risk of accidents and injuries for workers. Proper grading helps prevent settling or shifting of structures, which can lead to costly repairs and safety hazards. Effective grading prevents that water buildup, reducing the risk of flooding and erosion on the site and its neighboring properties. This is especially important for industrial developments with large buildings and equipment. Grading can minimize the environmental impact of construction by preserving natural features and managing water runoff responsibly. Investing in grading upfront can save money in the long run by avoiding issues like those drainage problems, unstable foundations, and environmental fines. That's all for today. Thanks for joining us from the Beehive.